Whoa, the turn by Youngso there. <laughs> wow. everyone, it's Garrison here and welcome back to the channel and today I am super duper excited right up and early because I'll be checking out none other than Purple Kiss and their latest release with seven plan words with heaven seven and heaven right uh, here with number seven. Love to see it that they are back after seeing Yuki go through a successful run on Queendom Puzzle. So the fact that we get a purple kiss comeback and then an L's up debut is spectacular every uh, one and it is also great seeing Yuki of course get more and more recognition for not only herself but you know purple kiss of course off of Queendom Puzzle and I feel like Queendom Puzzle has helped a lot of the group so far after the show we're seeing glimpses of it so far and hopefully that ends up being the case for Purple Kiss as well for this era of Festa. But aside from that, let's just dive into the music video now. All right, so brought it up here, Seven by Purple Kiss. Love the play on uh, words. I'm gonna have to find out for myself and how that connects with Seven and Heaven in terms of the lyrics and all for this. But I got the English captions on and all. Let's go. 24-7, okay. Heaven, 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 okay. <laughs> they have already answered my question right off the bat. Ooh. In the dozy. <laughs> Love the groove to this song so far. Three chorus kicking off with Swan. Ooh, some glistening synths here. Ooh. Love the bass plucks into the chorus here, but. <laughs> How bright and uplifting this song is truly everything so far. Seven, 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 seven. <laughs> seven. And the Yuki, of course, for verse two. Purple skies spreading. Mm. And I love this overall set that they have here. It's pretty much the same set that we got for that one team for Charismatic off of Queendom Puzzle with the car wash. <laughs> All those synth strings in the back there add so much depth to this song. Bridge. Okay, it's building back up again. Ooh, the psychedelic keyboard work. The bass bucks added in the mix. Yes, one. Ha <laughs> ha. 
Man, and I do mess with the line distribution for this song, just in terms of how, how, like, which member we get one after another, or how each and every single member plays off each other, you feel me? So very fitting, too, for this era of Festa, I've got to say, with Seven or Flash. Uh, heaven uh, here. Man, it is so great to see Purple Kiss back with a bright, fun, and uplifting release here. I can't stress this enough, guys. We don't get that much bright releases these days. And bright and sound, bright and concept all around. You feel me? And I feel like we're lacking those kind of releases, and I would love more and more. I'm not complaining when we get releases like this, especially by Purple Kiss on this more so bright uh, side that's very festival-like with it, hence Festa, of course, and uh, yeah, overall, I just love whether that be that slinky bass work, the bass pluck in the song that is so essential, the synth strings in the back in terms of those little of details i felt like everything was tied along together very well uh but for uh seven here i'm gonna actually search up who's working behind the scenes in this particular song because i think i'm hearing some influences that i've heard in the past before wow son young jin son young jin has worked with purple kiss in the past before was zzz, but also has worked with as one in the past before a huge noble name like that and of course none other one of my favorite songwriters out uh here is boran boran has worked on can't stop dreaming dreaming by purple kiss as uh well and then we have coco doop dubu papa um not too familiar with this uh individual oh has worked with mama Moo in the past before and one we in the past before we love to see it so we might end up seeing this individual working with purple kiss in the future as well assumingly they are maybe they're not from the rbw collective but regardless i think they did an incredible job in this song nothing too crazy in terms of the overall arrangement just straight up effective with it with the refrain which by the way, we got at the beginning of this song, which is utilized more and more as the song progresses. So I like how we got that refrain as an intro to preview us and, you know, to warm us in the song, you know what I'm saying? Like to set the tone of the song, you feel me? And then the pre-chorus set up the chorus so perfectly and cleanly in the song. So I'm gonna bring it back up here, break down my favorite parts uh, more so and all and yeah. <laughs> Just the overall chord progression is so beautiful. And this is the same car wash uh, setup and all for that one charismatic team that we saw from Queendom Puzzle in their performance video of all things. So I love the, the, the lighting, you know, for Purple Kiss here. Love the styling for this era too. <laughs> Ire is truly shine in this era. I've got to admit. Like some Ire. Dosi, she has her moments. And then I believe the fly high is the first. Um, well, actually, no, it is the pre chorus, if I recall correctly. like yuki in the mix here like honestly just the given lines here builds up the tension really well with the snare drum work and then release yeah <laughs> so that being said there's it, it pre essentially pretty much goes from refrain 
um and everything is so brief at the beginning and then we get hit with the chorus which is amazing everyone it doesn't take time for this song to kick off and hear those singular synth or those synth strings in the back there oh my goodness it adds so much to the song it's just shining it's gleaming in the back there <laughs> Man, Chain is such a bias wrecker. Oh, the vocal work. So immaculate. Love how they connect the lines with each other. And I know, like, just the overall breakdown, this is going to be verse 2, and... You know, is this either going to be Yuki or the likes of Dosi and none other than Yuki breaking it down here for us. Boogie on and on. It was great too, just seeing Yuki on Queendom Puzzle and some may know she looks up to none other than Icon's Bobby. And as some of you may know, Bobby do be one of my ultimate biases out there. So that kind of connection, I, I still can't believe it to this day for me. Yeah, that a bit of trap percussion breakdown there. The bass block, a lot of bass block. See, see what I'm saying here with the bass work, bass block. Day day. Wow, their vocals really shine in this song. Like, I feel like there's no heavy lifting between the production to the overall vocal work by all the members. I just feel like there's a perfect balance between the two, and that's a good thing, everyone. And notice how smooth, again, we go into the bridge, so smooth, transitioning into the bridge just like that, everyone. This is where the section of the song where they begin to descend us. This is the, the worth the while wait moment that we get. But not only this bridge, the, the follow-up of what happens High moment there by Goan, my bias. Breakdown with the psychedelic keyboard or keys being played here. With a dance break, like come on. To Swan. And the groove is just so recognizable ever since the start of the song on first listen man they get to flex their vocals really well in this well while yuki has good spotlightable moments creative choreo too like come on everyone i feel like everything was tied along together so well whether that be the fits the styling you know the setup sure one could see this as a performance video more so but like the fireworks several couple of different uh scenes at least for this uh era and fun moments where you see the members enjoy them themselves and their each and others uh, own uh company and all but let me know your thoughts about seven i think this is a really strong nine out of ten you know it's not crazy boundary breaking by any means but oh my goodness this is so up my alley in terms of personal taste and from an objective standpoint very well produced the hooks do more than its job the melodies are memorable what's there not to love but as always be sure to like and subscribe everyone fellow plories feel free to connect with me in the comment section down below timing could have been perfect early in the morning before I leave the city and all i could have missed out this release as a whole and be delayed for this but thankfully not take care as always this has been garrison and peace